Decades of alleged abuse by OSU team doctor Richard Strauss. And happening now, the fallout over one of the biggest scandals to rock the university continues. Victims say their voices are still not being heard. So tonight, they're making their presence known to the OSU Board of Trustees. Our Luann Stoya, live on campus tonight. Luann? Well, the first time today, Dr. Christina Johnson told survivors that she is deeply sorry for what happened. We got into this because we know what is right and what is wrong. And I want to see the university and the board of trustees to do what is right. Do, not say, because we've heard your words. We haven't seen your action. And Dr. Johnson saying what Richard Strauss did is inconscionable. Johnson says the university's failure to act at the time is unacceptable. In September, a federal judge dismissed the Strauss-related lawsuits for being filed past Ohio's two-year statute of limitations on sexual assault cases. While some survivors have settled their lawsuits, about 300 of the victims had not settled when that lawsuit was dumped. Speakers told the board OSU did not bargain in good faith and they are not going away. Strauss survivors told the trustees and they want to make sure that sexual assaults like they experienced here on campus never happens again. As for the trustees, they sat stoically. They had nothing to say. They did say pending the possible litigation, they were advised not to answer questions or talk with the survivors. We are live on campus on your side, Luann Stoya reporting.